How's it going? So I know there's a, a lot of questions on how to find a flex fuel sensor on a, uh, a 2000, uh, early 2000s uh, Ford Taurus, and I'm going to show you where to find them. I'm here in uh, Eupola in San Antonio, and I couldn't find anything on the internet saying where the hell these stupid sensors were, so I'm going to show you where to find them. So right here, I've got a 2000 Ford Taurus, and uh, you can see that they have the flex fuel badge here with FFV uh, stands for flex fuel vehicle. These come with the three liter Duratec motors. And if you open up the hood and look on the left shock tower, that's it right there behind uh, behind the windshield washer reservoir. So I'm gonna dig through my toolbox and see what kind of uh, bolt heads those are, and uh, we'll get that thing out. So this first head here, this is going to be a 5 sixteenths. And this side over here is going to be a 7 sixteenths. Once you have those two unbolted, you just have to worry about uh, cutting the fuel lines here. And then cutting the, uh, the wire to the pigtail way back here so you have some wires to splice into. And once you've uh, cut the pigtail, leave yourself uh, enough wires for the pigtail, and you've cut the fuel lines, you've basically got the, uh, the fuel sensor out. Now uh, you can unbolt this plate. Uh, these are two little Allen head uh, bolts here. I don't know what size they are, I don't really care. But um, there you go. You can pull these uh, flex fuel sensors out of the, uh, these four Tauruses uh, out of the junkyard for about 15 to 20 bucks. They work great with Mega Squirt. There's a write-up on how to use them in the manual. Um, so there you go. These uh, these brand new cost around $600. So getting it out of the junkyard for 20 bucks is a hell of a deal. So thanks for watching. I hope uh, hope this helps someone. Um, there you go.